What is going on everybody? My name is Pete and you guys are watching Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Vlogs, day number 1522. Coming at you once again with another brand new video. Hope you're all doing fantastic out there. Ladies and gentlemen, if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, uh, or any of the others, you, my friends, are in the right place to stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below. Turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. Uh, it just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. In fact, leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D. And let's jump into the email, Triple Lindy, Thornton Mellon style, and away we go. So this here comes from our buddy Dash for Cash, and he says the following. Hey Pete, just dropping you a line to show you how my shift started tonight and went downhill from there, if you can believe it. When I first started out in the gig world, I used to just shrug off these offers and wonder what the hell is DoorDash thinking and move on to the next. But now I'm actually getting depressed and not seeing a light at the end of the gig tunnel. So I have two questions for you. Number one, do you ever think we'll get back to the days when we felt like we were doing a job and seeing the rewards of what we felt worthy of or do you foresee DoorDash just getting away with beating veteran dashers into the ground until we quit? Since we seem to be so disposable and easily replaced. Now, I will get to the second question in just a moment. The answer I'm gonna give you here, I feel is a very realistic one. As much as I would love things to go back to the way they were, you know, in 2017, 2018, and 2019, the chances of that happening, I think, are kind of slim. Because the fact of the matter is this, these apps, Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, and the others, but the big three, they know that drivers are becoming smarter because of YouTube channels, social media, people helping each other, drivers helping each other with tips and tricks. They do not want drivers cherry picking and multi-apping, period, okay? They want drivers to accept the majority of the orders that they send them, even though as independent contractors, we are allowed to decline as many as we want, these companies hate that. So they have consistently been making changes over the past few years to keep cutting down on the cherry picking and multi-apping. And as we have seen in the last six months to 12 months, that's been happening with drivers being paused, with drivers being deactivated, with drivers, you know, being logged out. I, I hate to say it, but I don't, I don't foresee it going back that way. And that's just a realistic response. Question two, I've got to admit, I don't know your life story or its trials and tribulations, but you always seem to be upbeat and even have a way of breaking bad news on us which needs to be dropped on us so we're informed. So the hell with your critics putting you down for telling us what we're up against. You're just saying it like it is, in Dino's words. So again, stay safe and healthy, dash for cash. As far as me being upbeat, um, before, before I started pay to drive, I was just a very, very negative, pessimistic person. Now, a lot of people confuse that with the topics of a lot of my videos, but the fact is I report to you what is sent to me, what I experience, what I read, what I see. So if I see something negative, which happens to be the majority of the time, that's what I'm going to share with you guys because the fact is we don't like to hear negative and bad news but it's essential to hear it so that we're prepared in case it comes our way or should I say when it comes our way, okay? Trust me, I would love to just report great stuff constantly. Uh, they're giving money away. They're giving free stuff away. Drivers are getting a big raise. Drivers are gonna get more orders. You know, I, I would love for it to be constant positivity. And that's why any opportunity I can to make a, a positive content, I put it out as fast as possible so that you guys can get a relief from a lot of the, the pessimism and the negativity. Um, but as far as being upbeat, I just try my hardest 
to, you know, let things just, you know, bounce off me and just, you know, through one ear and out the other and just keep moving. Got to keep moving forward, you know? So, I don't know. Like It's like the, the Tom Hanks quote. Tomorrow the sun will rise and who knows what the tide will bring. We don't know. So we'll have to see. So drivers, if you have anything you ever want to share with me, a comment, a topic, an article, a story, whatever you have, send me an email at paytodrivestories at gmail.com. Takes two seconds, very simple. Or for a quicker response, you guys can message me on Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. The link for that is in the description of the pin top comment. Definitely go and check that out. And uh, anyone who signs up as a patron as my way of saying thank you, <clears throat> as I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos, which I'm gonna do right now. So when you hear your name called, say, hey Pete, I heard my name. We've got John Birchfield, David Moore, Angela Counts McCarty, Steel United 111, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, uh, Heidi Barnes, uh, Jimmy Santiago, Joe Valerio, Kurt Paul, Laura Love, Tulsa Todd, Agus, Alan G. Van Horn, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Haviland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, um, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Tom Perry, Brian Richardson, Candace Mitchell, Jenny Thomas, Joyce Hine, LaDonna Roten, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, Valerie Brown, and Rebecca Swenson. Huge shout outs to every single one of you guys out there. Really, really appreciate that. So with that being said, my friends, um, yeah, definitely go check it out. Who's going to be the next patron? Maybe it'll be one of you. And of course, I hope every single one of you is saving lots of money out there on your gas with the free gas app called Get Upside. Links in the description down below. Scroll down to where it says Get the Free Gas App. Then you click on that link. It'll tell you how to download it or install it on whatever kind of phone, tablet, or device you have. And then from there, what you got to do is you go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description down below. Make sure to download it today. And of course, if you guys want one of these awesome Live to Drive, Drive to Live t-shirts, you can get your own at paytodrivestore.com. Links in the description or the pin top comment. Definitely go check that out. We have lots of brand new design, designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day. Paytodrivestore.com is the place for you. Go check that out. And with that being said, everybody, uh, if you made it to the end of this video, simply leave a comment saying END210, END210, just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. In fact, leave a comment saying LIKED, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling, keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Pay to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Later.